Hey, good evening, everybody. I got the uh, two little ones here to help me out. We got a special project we're going to try to get done before dinner, and uh, we wanted you guys to join us. Hey, so we we uh, have been kind of taking all the fruit scraps and throwing them away, and I kind of talked to the uh, wife about trying to find reasonable way of maybe composting and, and getting that started. I think we're gonna build a uh, bigger compost pile wherever some race beds are gonna go in the future. But uh, I think for now, instead of constantly throwing away really good food scraps that we can uh, turn into something, we're going to uh, build a little bucket that we can uh, store them in and maybe get some compost started. So this would be small scale. So uh, first things first, doesn't really matter what brand, but I've got an assortment of trumpets here um, for any size that you, you may want or need. Um, a good drill with a charged battery, that's very important. Um, I've got a few buckets. I'll show you why I have two uh, when we get to that point. One of them is full of some hay we have left over from uh, seeding the yard, which that worked out great. Um, I have some, uh, I call it malorganite, but it's sunny land, all natural, slow release fertilizer. And uh, packed full of nitrogen, I think really what it is is um, manure that they've kind of pelletized or uh, dried out. The other thing, we got some uh, green uh, green scraps, which is from a watermelon we just cut up. Um, this is just the first batch of food that we've got. I'm gonna take this, these big chunks, and cut them down into smaller. Uh, and then there's our second bucket. We've got nothing in it. This is gonna be um, the yeah, this is going to be like the vessel that uh, we're going to we're going to uh, tear up essentially. So, um, oh, also we've got um, a little uh, gardening pail with water in it that we're going to soak everything with. So the first part of this project is we're going to take that bucket and we're going to drill some holes in the bottom of the bucket, and we're going to drill some holes up the side of the bucket uh, to add some air. We're going to go with a smaller bit on the bottom and a bigger one up top probably going to go maybe midways on it we're probably going to use a let's see what size this is a 3 16th i believe I'm, I'm missing a drill bit so actually it may be an 11 64th but anyways 3 16th will probably be fine we we'll use that on the bottom kendall you want to you want to take that well that'll be our first one and on the sides we'll probably use this half inch if i can get this out of here one-handed Kendall, you want to take that one too? Awesome. All right, we'll get it loaded up in the drill, and then uh, we're going to drill out the bottom, and then uh, drill out the midsection. Olivia, do you want to drill the bottom? Yeah. Pull the trigger. Pull the trigger. Got it? Okay. So I'm going to hold it. I'm going to hold it for you. You drill it. Okay. You ready? Go ahead. Pull the trigger. Let it go. Let it, here, keep going, keep going. One more time. Keep going. One more time. All right. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Four more, okay? Can you do four more for me? You, you want to do the four more? Okay, watch out. Let's go, Kim. So we're gonna do one right here in the middle. Awesome. Keep going. Let's go. So we need to pull the trigger going in and pull the trigger going out. So 
So if you can see, we put a bunch of um, holes on the bottom. They're not so big to where the food and stuff is going to fall out, but uh, they're big enough that we can just get air to come up through here. We're going to line the bottom of this. Uh, <laughs> we're going to line the bottom of this five-gallon bucket with hay first to start out with, and uh, we'll pile all our juicy, uh, wet, and food stuff on top of that dirt and everything else. So, You ready, Kendall? You you hold it. I'll grab. I'll hold the bottom just so you don't drop it. But you can do both hands. You can do both hands. All right. You ready? Right here. Right there. Pull the trigger. Yeah, push. There you go. Pull the trigger. Oh. All right. Wow, that was a big. So little air can come in, and then yep. more air can come out. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Right there. Let me see. I want to do the side. Okay, close your eyes. Look up. All right, last one. Last one. Okay. All right, we're going to go right here. Awesome. Okay. All right, so we are done with the drill. And we can show everyone in YouTube land, right? YouTube land. Show everyone in YouTube land. Oh. So the, the yeah the first the first uh, thing we want to do is take about a um Kendall take about it or Olivia take a handful of the hay. We'll take a handful of the hay out of the bucket and put it, nope uh. just a handful just a handful. That's good. Yeah. Now put it on the bottom of the, of our new bucket, the one with holes in it. There you go. There you go. Set it down in there. Don't pack it too tight. Just set it down in there. That should be perfect. That should be perfect. I'm going to cut up some of these watermelons. Can, can you just take that water over there? Don't You don't have to pour anything in it just yet. Okay. Just take it over. So we're going to start making our compost now? Hey, baby girl, put that bucket down. Out. It's not going to get out. The holes are too small. All right, you ready? Yes. Someone come get this watermelon and pour on top of the hay. I want to do that. Go ahead and let, let Levy do it first, please. Mm -hmm. No, take the whole thing. Huh? Take the whole thing. You can each put it on do top it of the twice. hay. This one or this one? The, the, the one with the holes in it. This one. There you go. All right, bring it back. And then my turn. Yeah, it's going to be in a pedal. Stay away from the knife. Stay away from the knife. Yeah. Okay. Here you go. All right. We uh, we were back from uh, eating dinner. We uh, tried to be as quick as we can. Here's a look at the shed. Got all the uh, wall girts up and um, got her looking real nice. Still trying to wait for uh, steel to get the order put in. So, anyways. All right, so the bucket here has got um, hay on the bottom, and then I chopped up some of those bigger pieces of watermelon and threw that on top of the hay. I think what I'm gonna do now is grab a scoop of this uh, Sunnyland fertilizer, which um, that's what's inside the bag. 6% nitrogen. We'll get a scoop of that. There you go, get a look at it. It's really made for uh, like lawns, we're gonna just uh, sprinkle that right on top. Um, there you go. I think that's I think that's good enough. And uh, what we'll do is, Kendall, can you pick that bucket up? The bucket with the um, with the with the watermelon in it. Can you pick that bucket up. Which is the bucket with the holes. Bucket with the holes. We're gonna take this bucket over here and uh, put a few scoops of dirt on top of it. Um, I need to get better about getting coffee grounds from work. I, I probably make a half a pot of coffee every day I go in, so um, I wouldn't be hard, too hard to uh, find. And we, we go through coffee by, by the gallons, it seems like. This is, this is as how good I can get it. That's fine, you get it as good as you can. We're gonna add some dirt into the bucket. To get the dirt, we gotta get some of this sand out of the way. And I'm just gonna put some dirt on top. Here, there you go. I think that'll work. I don't know. 
and I'm gonna chop it up inside a bucket. So I got, here you go, look inside the bucket. I got some dirt in the bucket and uh, the nitrogen's underneath that, watermelon under that, hay under that. Uh, we're gonna go add some water to it and we're just gonna do another layer, right? Yeah. Let's go. And, yeah, they can do it. I'm gonna put a little bit of water on there just to, just to kind of soak in. They can't really tell because of how light is, is it is. Is it dark? You mean too dark? Um, how about that? Can you see it? Looks like mud. <laughs> there you go. A little bit of pineapple berries. Pine pineapple? I mean, watermelon. Watermelon. I always get pineapple and watermelon mixed up. Really? Yeah. They're definitely two different plants, though. They're two different fruits. Yeah. All right. So maybe. How about that? How's that look? We got some more hay and in our, in our little bucket over here. Pull up the rest of the watermelon. Yeah, we got some more watermelon to put in. I said it correctly this time. Yep, watermelon. We'll sprinkle some more nitrogen on top of it. That nitrogen fertilizer. And then put another layer of dirt. Yep. Add on. Yep. Hay. Exactly. Watermelon dirt. Hay, watermelon, dirt. All right, water. Want, hay, dirt. watermelon, dirt. Water. You want to follow me again over here? Sure. But they won't see your whole body. Just some of your boots. Well, don't don't do that. I mean, I mean, they'll see your head, but on the bottom, they they will see just part of your boots and not much of the bucket. Not much of the bucket. Yeah. Okay. You do the best you can. All right. Okay. I think this is going to work out perfect. Chopping it up in there. It's okay. Those spiky weeds. So we're just going to put... Oops, leaking out the sides. Oh, no. It's okay. It's okay. Get to the hospital. We need to bandage up those holes. No, it's okay. <laughs> It'll be just fine. There's Livia. Mama, I mean, Papa, Livia's out. Hey, Livia. Whoa, God, don't get too close. How was dinner? Good. What'd you eat for dinner? Um, sloppy joes and mac and cheese. Sloppy joes and mac and cheese. Yep. What else did you eat? Um, well, the mullet and the mac and cheese. Watermelon mac and cheese. Wait, and I just ate the same thing, but what did we have in the sloppy joes? What was your favorite part? Hey, cheese! Cheese. Okay. So there's the uh, bucket. I may have put the holes just a little too low on the sides, but uh, it's okay. It was a three dollar bucket, so we'll make do with uh, what we have. Mm -hmm. But we uh, got two layers out of it: hay, watermelon, um, some nitrogen, and uh, dirt, and then hay, watermelon, nitrogen, dirt again. I'm gonna throw that bucket on top. On top, right there. Just to kind of keep as much moisture as we can. You know what, Kendall? Can you um, can you go grab another handful of hay and bring it over here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Grab another handful I of that hay, it. and we'll just throw it on top. I'm sorry. But how close is two handfuls or one? Just one handful. Okay. Show me what you got before you come back. That'll work right there. Yep. That's perfect. Daddy, can I have the one? Here, why don't you hold the bucket and you can put it on top when we're done. If you have a seven-year-old kid, they might be able to hold this much. Here you go. It might be pulled. Does that bucket have anything in it? No. Okay. This bucket? There you go. Ooh. Perfect. Yep. Now, let me, let me put that other bucket on top so it doesn't... All that, all that but it looks away. like it would be easy to blow away. Can you push down on it, Libby? No, it's Press it nice and tight. Sister power! Sister power! There you go. All right, let go. Perfect. Okay. Hopefully, this is a quick little video. And uh, I know the girls enjoyed being in it. Right, girls? Yeah. Two thumbs up. A thousand. A thousand thumbs up. I can't. All right. I don't have that. So, uh, if you like this little video with the girls and uh, and us having having a little bit of fun Hello. before and after dinner, uh, hit that like button and uh, please subscribe to the channel for more. I'm gonna try to get them a lot more involved in uh, day to day. I didn't get to spend much time with them since uh, I worked a long shift today, but um, try to try to do a little odd, odds and ends like this uh, when I get home from work too get them involved. So from uh, Olivia, Kendall, and myself, hope you guys have a good night and we'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Say bye. 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 Hope to see you next time.